Jessalyn? Yes? You're safe. I don't... know who you are. Nancy, Wade hired me to help find you. Really? Wade? Yeah, he seemed really worried. Oh, man. My family's just a hot mess. What is wrong with us? Nancy, you can't tell anyone you've seen me. No one. So you did run away? No, I, I can't say what happened. And you can't either. I can't agree to that. I came here to find you. Good for you, but I came down here not to be found. Let me help you. Fine. You haven't left me much of a choice. You were hiding out in the tunnels because you and Harper are working together? Why? I didn't come here intending anything more than a good scare. Harper found out I was coming and snuck up on me. She almost died. I had to give her a paper bag for the breathing to calm her down. <laughs> You shouldn't be proud of that! Oh, grow up. You didn't die. I'd been told my whole life that Harper was crazy. What a coincidence. Me too! <laughs> Ignore her for a second. Come here. Secrets don't make friends. Look, she's not as nuts as she seems. That, as they say, is debatable, my dear lamb. Stop it! She needs to know! Leave if you don't want to listen, but it needs to be said. I'm sorry, Jessalyn. I'll go. The night of the fire, Harper was there. My whole life, my mother's kept me away from Harper. Said it was for my own good. I came here looking for Charlotte's ghost, but instead Harper found me. She told me that my mother was responsible for Charlotte's death. And I stayed to listen. I didn't laugh. I didn't run away, I stayed and listened to every word. Because my mother, because she's so cold. And I believe that it might be true. I don't know if I'm going crazy or if I'm already there, but I have to know. Please, I need your help. Do you think seeing the fire is what made Harper, Harper? Imagine carrying a secret that big for so long, not having anyone listen. What can I do to help? We've been doing this Harper's way, but we're running out of time. I need you to get the necklace from my mother's briefcase. I'll get Harper to distract her. Why? What's so special about it? Charlotte told Harper to open the locket if anything ever happened to her. But if we don't open it the right way, it'll destroy what's inside. Here, this will help you open the briefcase. My mother knows about the locket. That's why she never lets the necklace out of her sight. You need to find a way to get it. Do you know that Colton is here? I don't have time for that right now. Please go find the necklace and bring it to me. What made you trust Harper? I wish I could explain. I've been asking myself the same thing. My mother had us convinced that Harper was dangerous. I think my mother's been putting this whole family under her thumb. Me included. To keep us from finding whatever it was Charlotte was about to do. Sorry to bring it up, but were you aware that Colton's seeing someone else? I'm not all that surprised, to be perfectly honest. You're not? No. The whole thing was mainly my mother's idea. Do you know about Lexi? Colton and I were never in love. We were in a mess. He loved Lexi, and I hope he goes back to her. Goodbye. Goodbye. Speak. You were working with Jessalyn this whole time. I don't know. Go ask her yourself.
Yes. Goodbye. Take care. I think I could really use a break. When I get home, we're doing something fun. My thoughts exactly. Everyone else is letting me down. George is gone. Joe's discovered hiking, which Nancy is just walking. That's what it is. But it doesn't stop him from talking about it. And Frank is, I don't know what Frank's problem is. He's all sullen and he keeps talking about needing to grow up and maybe get an MBA or something. You gotta come back and restore balance to the world. Also, Ned's going to need a break from me. Mm-hmm. See? The silence speaks volumes. I found Jesselyn. Hello? That's good news. <sighs> Hooray! She's alive! You gotta mention that up front! What happened? Harper snuck up on her the night she disappeared. I knew it! No, wait. It's not what you think. At least, maybe not. Harper has always been convinced that Charlotte's death wasn't accidental, that Clara was behind it. She's been trying to get to Jesselyn for years, but Clara had convinced Jesselyn Harper was crazy, which probably wasn't hard. When Jesselyn finally heard what Harper had to say, I think part of her knew it might be true. If she even considered that it might be true... Yeah, if someone said that about my mom, I'd roll my eyes. Do you think it might be true? I don't know. Jesselyn doesn't seem like she'd be willing to let so many people worry about her unless there was some truth to it. Why not just go to the police? Charlotte's death was ruled accidental. Harper needed Jesselyn's help to gather evidence from Clara or no one would believe her. I still need to find a way to help Jesselyn. Wait, hang on. So does this explain the ghosts? Mostly. Jesselyn and Harper were dressing up as Charlotte. I still don't understand why they do that. It made it easy for them to move through the house without Clara knowing exactly who was there or that Jesselyn wasn't really missing. And I think Harper wanted to use Charlotte's ghost to scare Clara into confessing. <laughs> but that didn't work. This is like, what was that play we saw in school but I didn't finish because I got sick halfway through? Hamlet? That's it. How's that end? Um, pretty much everyone dies. Why show that to a bunch of kids? It's art? Ugh! Art is terrible! I'm done with art. It's just crafts from now on. And while I'm at it, would you take a break from the dark cases for a while? <laughs> Happily. Goodbye. Take care. found Jesselyn. Well, that's a relief. Not quite. She went into hiding to find evidence that would prove that Clara... Killed Charlotte. How did you know? I didn't till just now. I met her once. She had the type of smile that never met her eyes. Now I know why. Jesselyn said something you might want to hear. When you phrase it like that, I know I don't. She said Clara has a habit of discrediting anyone who could find out her secret. She convinced the family Harper was nuts. And she did her best to see Wade punished for something that wasn't fair. Is that what you were going to say? Yes. Hun, I didn't leave Wade because of Wade. I left because I wasn't strong enough to stand up to all that darkness. If Jessalyn Harper and I can do what needs to be done, you won't be alone in that fight. Nancy, as my daddy said to me, you, dear, are a pain in the rear. Then it sounds like I'm in good company. I'd better get going. Later, hon.
What do you want from me? The coast is clear. Time to snoop. Locked. I need to figure out the right combination. Got it. This must be what Jessalyn was looking for. Check. Hi. I found the necklace. Good. Wait, shoot. It's missing a front piece. I need you to find it as fast as you can. It triggers the opening mechanism. This necklace was used by spies in the Civil War. If you open it without the missing piece, it shreds the message inside. I found the locket. Here. I can't open it. I'm going to need your help. This looks like it matches one of the notes I found. Check. Can't check. Did that. That's it. Here you go. What's it say? I can't. I'm gonna go see her myself. Whoa. If Jessalyn confronts Clara, things could get dangerous fast. That's done. I need to find a way to light the tunnel first. If I can get this working, it should light up the tunnel. The motor won't work unless I find a way to move that ball bearing down into the shaft.
that's done.